Where would you think I lived if I told you temperatures could be over 100 degrees one day and dip below 40 within eight hours? Summers are scorchers, and we try to set the record number of days over 100 degrees. Yes, I am a Texas country girl living in the big city, Dallas, Texas. Hi, I'm Susan Watkins. After graduating high school, I moved to Rogers, Arkansas, where summers are summers, <laughs> winters are winters, and fall is a display of God's beautiful, colorful creation. I love living in the mountains, fishing in the rivers, and Beaver's man-made lake. Secluded mountain life is fun, but I miss my home state of Texas and the fast-paced city life. After a year in Arkansas, I moved back to Texas where the nightlife is happening and I'm closer to family and friends. But the real reason is I miss the crazy, ever-changing weather and my fun-loving family. So you can get to know a little bit more about what I'm all about. Other than what I have lived, where, where I have lived, I would like to share with you four important objects in my life that will give you more complete picture of me and why I live a fun, why I live life to the fullest. My first object is my family, which represents what I believe people see in me. You may think that I started a family young, which my parents would probably agree. My ability to kick cancer's butt and be a six-year survivor is because of the love and the support of my family. My family is my proudest and greatest accomplishment. This brings me to my second object, which is fear, which reveals something that is hidden about me. Being diagnosed with cancer at the age of 39 gave me a fear of dying. Like many others diagnosed with cancer, dying was their biggest fear. Keeping this fear to myself protected my family from pain. Prayers and faith have helped me overcome this fear. This brings me to my third object, which is soccer, athlete, how people see me that I don't completely agree with. The love I have for playing soccer does not make me an athlete, although my other teammates think, may think different. You may think 40 years of playing soccer makes an athlete, although I look at it as a passion. My love for soccer does not make me good at it. Continuing to play soccer is it, all these years is due to the group of friends I play with. This brings me to my fourth and final object which is heart, which is the perception of how my best friend sees me. Love mends and cures all things as long as you put your heart into it. I would do anything for anyone in need, giving them the shirt off my back. I always include everybody and never leave anyone out. I love with my whole heart and make sure everyone is taken care of. So now you know a little more about me other than just being your classmate. I am blessed beyond words with an amazing family that has helped me overcome my fear with a passion for soccer and a heart that loves all. Thank you very much for spending this time with me and I look forward to learning more about you.